How are you today? It's been a while since I made a video and I want to give you a little something different today. I want you to meet Mama Roxy. Well, starting off, my name is Roxy Kelly and I'm 48 years old. I have fibromyalgia and I have lupus. Oh my goodness, when they kick in together, baby, I have a horrible time. Today is one of those days, but I wanted to let you know that no matter what you're going through or how you feel in or anything, it's about you. You got to get up and make the best of everything. That's what I do. I got a great support system. I have four children, which are 30, 26, 24, and 22. And I have seven grandbabies. And under no circumstances must I appear to be weak. I have to get up and do things that I don't feel like doing. I have to put that smile on my face. And I have to be encouraging. I have sometimes, I, a lot of times I cook. And I clean up all the time, no matter what. I put my face on and I have to smell good all the time. Because that's for me. Not just appearance for everybody else, but for me. You have to motivate yourself sometimes. But whatever you go do, you always put the Lord and Savior first. God is first. Encourage yourself. I encourage myself to get up and do what I can. It's been so long and I just want y'all to know that if I can do it, you can do it. If you're fighting cancer, lupus, fibromyalgia, high blood pressure, overweight, whatever. Whatever it is, you can do whatever you want to do because it's about you. That's how I feel. I fight every single day. It's at times, y'all, where I end up in the hospital and I'm be there for two or three days. Or it's just times where I just need to go and they give me extra medication when my medication don't work. Times where I can't get out the bed. So it's going to be times where I film you guys and I'm going to be in the bed. Sometimes my little page is about life. Makeup. I love makeup. It makes it takes me to another level. It makes me feel outstanding and sexy. No matter how I'm feeling on the inside. My outside going to look nice. I'm going to smell good. And I'm going to dress nice. And I'm going to carry myself like a woman. When I go see them doctors and them nurses, I'm not under no circumstances going to take out how I feel on them. Because without them, honey, hell, I would be so out of shape and out of whack and crazy and pain. It would be ridiculous. It's the same thing to go with other people around me. Why should you know exactly how I'm feeling? Why should I show you that I feel terrible or that my body is breaking down on me and I don't know how I'm going to make it? That's not for you to know. It's not for me to holler at you and fuss at you and cuss at you and make you feel terrible. No, that's not my job. My job is to uplift you because you uplifting me. You're giving me that opportunity to smile and laugh and joke and be the person that I really am all the time. Not just when I'm sick, but all the time. I'm going to be me. I'm funny. I'm playful. I crack jokes, honey, and I like to talk about everybody. You can talk about me, too, because I'm going to talk about me, too, too, you know? I'm not no little woman. I'm a big woman, a big sexy woman. I smell good and dress nice. I do my little nails. I keep a smile on my face, even when I don't feel like smiling. So the point of this is telling you that even though you feel like an ass or you feel like you're sick or you hurting and you just can't handle it no more, it's not for you to be an ass. Not for you to take it out on nobody else. People trying to love you and make you feel better. So you grab on to that. Grab on to that. And let that let that love lift your spirits and your heart and your mind. And, and your body will begin to feel a little better too. My grandson came in today and told me they love, I love you, Nanny. My son made me a little breakfast this morning and I had some tea. Still drinking my little green tea. 
but they love me. And I got to show them that I love them even on my worst days. Because they already know that I love them on my best. Same thing go with God. I thank him every day when I'm at my best. But I thank him even more when I'm at my worst. Because it could make it to the point where I'm not here. But I am. I want to do things and I want to show y'all things. I got a new little Ipsy bag in today. And I got other little makeup to show y'all. You see it? But it's not about the makeup today. I got perfume, y'all. It's not about none of that. It's about me talking to y'all and telling you guys that if I can do it, you can do it. If I can get up and make myself feel the way that I am, that I'm not that I that I am not the way that I feel, then y'all can do it too. It do perk you up a lot. When you put them makeup on and your face is looking pretty, my hair look crazy because when my fibromyalgia and my lupus kick in, it messes with my hair and it breaks my hair out. But I just want to tell you, I'm not going to continue with this much longer, but I want your comments and I want your questions and anything you want to know, you can talk to me. We can talk about men and relationships and sex and makeup and whatever, life itself. Just ask Mama Roxy. I'm going to tell you. And what I don't know, we're going to figure it out together, baby. But I want to thank all of you that have subscribed to me, that have watched my videos. I love y'all. I appreciate everything about y'all. And, and whatever I can help y'all do, just like y'all help me, then ask me. Let me know what you need. And I'm going to ask you questions, even at my worst. But I just want to tell y'all I love you. And thank you for listening to me. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for watching the videos. Just thank you. God bless you all. Mama Roxy says have a beautiful, beautiful day. And I'll be coming back at you real soon. Probably with a little bit more better equipment, though. <laughs> I love y'all. Thank you very much for listening. And write your little comments down below. And ask me whatever you want. I'm going to answer them. No matter what it is, we can have crazy talk. That's me. Ask Mama Roxy and I got you. We'll talk about makeup in a couple of days or something. But it's not really about makeup. It's about life today. And whatever you want to ask, feel free. Love you and have a beautiful and blessed day.